Uh, yes, you, you, can, you can detect a trisomy 21 or the Down syndrome in embryos if you do PGS on them. The, there are three types of PGS. Uh, one of, the, of them detects if the uh, number of chromosomes is correct or not. You can also detect if there are translocations or if the chromosomes have exchanged parts of them. Or you can check if there, is, if there are mutations inside of the chromosomes. Of these three, the first one is the so-called PGTA because we are detecting aneuploidies. And aneuploidies are all these abnormalities that, uh, and that means that the embryo has extra chromosomes or lack of one chromosome. If they have an extra chromosome, that's called a triploidy, like the sit down syndrome, which is a 21 triploidy. If the embryo only has one chromosome, it's called a monosomy. And all these abnormalities, either in excess or because the embryo lacks of that chromosomes, can be detected by the PGS.